snow, lots of snow. Ladies and gentlemen, we're trying to pass the Tebow sign, communicating our descent into the Denver area. What's up you guys? Matt here with Static Studios and I've decided it's time to update you guys on the what's happened in the last three years. You know, it's the last time I did a whole bunch of you know regular uploads it was you know, about three years ago and a lot's changed. You know, obviously the first thing you see is uh, from that little pre-clip there before my intro is I've lost some weight. Um, yeah, I've you know I had back issues well I still have back issues but one of the things the doctors told me was lose weight so I lost some weight holy Jesus Oy. oh goodness anyways all morons aside here yeah I've lost weight I've been over 200 pounds since what was it fifth grade sixth grade it was since I moved here to Arizona and um, yeah I am for the first time under 200 I lost somewhere between 60 to 70 pounds, so I'm now currently about 190. Go me. <laughs> it was no easy accomplishment. You know, I was cutting out a lot of soda, um, cutting out a lot of snacks, uh, things like that. I also used the uh, an app called My Fitness Pal. Uh, let me track everything, and you know, I was a fan of fast food, so I could scan in my you know my meal really quick, and it was really cool. It really helped me monitor what I was you know taking in, and uh, yeah. It's it's amazing. You know, the doctors said physical therapy, chiropractor. You know, I did all that stuff, and uh, the last thing was the weight loss. And yeah, I was I was taking a a big cocktail of pain management stuff, and I'm no longer taking that. You know, I feel a lot better without it. I've got a lot more energy, and I'm happier. So, anyways, there's a lot more to to discuss. I got I gotta pay attention to this driving here because people are starting to act like morons. Eh figure Arizona so yeah I'm gonna pick up in just a moment with the next update so stay tuned oh the drive home yeah it's a little bit longer of a drive now guys because yeah since the last time you saw you know saw us here yeah static studios has moved twice twice <laughs> so you know <clears throat> about what was it February 2013 um, Megan and I went up into the Midwest for a quick trip to visit family and stuff. And yeah, you know, I'm going to show that video at the very end of this. We uh, we went up to Illinois for a, for a trip, and then a month later we ended up going right back. But that time on a one-way ticket. Due to circumstances out of you know people's control, um, we ended up taking on two additional members into our household. Um, the uh, last trip that we went up to uh, Illinois, the one after the video you'll see at the end, was to move her parents down here to Arizona. And uh, for the last 19 months they've lived with us. Uh, Megan and I, we moved from our one bedroom apartment into a two bedroom. And ultimately we had we needed more space so we moved into an apartment, into a house out here in Grand Ole Apache Junction. Which I mean is really, really cool because look, the mountains are like right there. <laughs> Yeah, uh, you can basically spit on the mountains from my house. It's great. It, it was quite, quite a, quite a change for me. Um, you know, I'd never really lived with roommates before. You know, Megan was the first time I'd ever had a roommate, even though we were, you know, in love and stuff. But um, yeah, it's. Uh, I feel very fortunate that we've been able to uh, extend ourselves and open up our household to be able to to help them out. Um, you know, provide a solid provide a stable household, you know, a roof over the head and everything. It's it's been nice you guys because, you know, that's why I was home chase. I, I love helping people and that's what we're doing. That's what we've been doing for the last 19 months. So which kind of takes me into my next topic, you guys. Last but not least, Megan and I went up to to Oregon. And yeah, you know, I, I, I think it was I, I, I think that you know, the last 19 months has kind of helped open my eyes to uh, see just how amazing she is. You know, taking on two extra people has been difficult. I mean, I'm not going to lie. It's, you know, just like you 
all read online, it does put a, you know, put a strain on your relationship, puts you know, an additional layer of stress and stuff like that. And, you know, I'm used to being, I was used to being a solo person, you know, making all the command decisions myself. So, yeah, it's, you know, it's just been a, been an eye-opening experience. And, you know, we've, we've had good times and we've had some tough times, but, you know, we've always made it through. And that's why back in June of this year, we went up to Oregon for a week. And on the, the, the plan was we were going to spend a few days out on the coast and then a few days inland in Oregon City. Um, I was able to show her around where I'm from. Went out to eat at all the yummy restaurants that I remember and stuff. But on the first night there, we stayed in this little hole in the wall that we found in Lincoln City. I've been to Lincoln City so many times, you guys. I mean, I grew up on the beach there. You know, we always stayed at the Inn of Spanish Head. That's where my brother and his wife got married. And uh, the place that we stayed was actually about a half mile north, you know, walking beach-wise. It was about a half mile north. It was really cool. You know, really nice place. Beautiful. The beach was right off our bedroom. I mean, it was like you look out the window, it was just an ocean. It was awesome. And that first night, I proposed. Yep, that's right. We're getting married. August 2016, La Jolla, California. Why La Jolla? We love it there. We love Southern California. And, uh, yeah, it's... I went up, or we went up, I proposed, she said yes, and yeah, I have a fiance, we're engaged. Never thought that would happen to me, and I just, I don't know, you know, going on the trips with Megan, seeing where she's from, you know, all the things that we've done together, all of the memories that we've had, the trips that we've taken, you know, the good times, the bad times, the obstacles that we've made it through, you know, we've built our relationship, and we're really, really strong. And, yeah, I'm, I'm happy. I'm, oh, okay. I just saw a fire truck pass, now that. Um, um, but yeah, guys, I'm really happy with her. You know, she's, she's my better half. She brings out the best in me. And she makes me laugh, she makes me smile, she makes me just crack up inside. She finishes my sandwiches, I mean, my, sen my sentences. <laughs> but yeah, it's, she's wonderful, you guys. And, I'm so thankful to have her in my life. Yeah, you know, we met online. It was a quick little whirlwind type of romance. Dated every night. Look, mountains. And yeah, I mean, we, you know, people thought that we moved in too quickly. And yeah, I mean, I had some concerns too. But you know, when things just fall into place, they just fall into place. And I haven't had a regret since. So. With that being said, you guys, I'm going to wrap this video up. As you see, you know, it's kind of been in chunks, but you know, I've shot this over the last few days. This is the first video I've actually scripted out because it's been a big update. So I wanted to make sure I got all the details. You know, I got the weight loss, I got the moves, I got the moving in the future in-laws, and I got the engagement update. So that's it. And that's all I got. So be sure to like, favorite, and subscribe, and leave your comments below, and I'll see you guys soon. Oh, and be sure to check out the Goose Lake video because here it comes. Enjoy. What's up, you guys? Matt here from Static Studios. As you can see, I am not in Arizona anymore. So, we, uh, Megan and I decided to take a trip up here, up to the Midwest for, you know, a week's vacation. Spend time with family up here and stuff. And a uh, large uh, snowstorm from the Midwest decided to move on, move on in, and uh, here it is. Burr.